Hi everyone, welcome to Kids Corner. Today we're going to do a Smithsonian experiment and it's to grow some prehistoric sea monsters. So here's the box. Uh, it comes with an aquarium, a background, one bag of triop eggs, one bag of triop food, one bag of sand, and a color poster with instruction. What it doesn't tell you is that you're going to need some distilled water and a thermometer. So we had to go and buy this. So we went shopping this morning and we got this. Now we're ready to open the box. So here's the aquarium. What All a right. nice bag of triop eggs. That's right. the new nutrition. Triop eggs. Nutrients. Back in nutrients. nutrients. Here's the little. What does that mean? Picture? Background picture that we're gonna put at the back Pack here. The food. Now the so that's what our aquarium gonna look like. Is this for food? What does it say on the packet, Jacob? Oh. The sand. Is the sand? Okay. Assemble your aquarium, Jacob. What are the instructions? Assemble your aquarium. So, stick this here, but how can we? I think I it's... I think we need some scotch tape. Do you want to go and get it? Do you know what it is? Can you take a grab it, Mum? So we got some sand. What does it do? What do you do with the sand? Can you put it in? Yeah? Put it before the water or what? Pour the entire bag of sand into the aquarium. So rinse out the aquarium with distilled or filtered water. So we have to rinse out the aquarium. So I stop this now, we're gonna rinse out the aquarium. Rinsing the aquarium, rinsing the aquarium. Alright. Alright, now we're going to stick the picture on you. Yeah, the picture, thanks, Noemi. Putting the picture on the aquarium. And you put it on and you put it down over there. You think two pieces is enough? Mm -hmm. No, I think for the bottom two. Alright, we need one at the bottom. Okay. Next, pour the entire bag of sand into the aquarium. Here's the sand. All right, put the sand in. All of it. Oh, it's got another bag, Jacob. It's tricky. Yeah. Okay, take it out. All right. Does this get paper eggs? I think no, it doesn't have the eggs. I think it's scissors. Scissors. Just do a little bit. Filling up the aquarium with the sand. Just hmm. going. There's a lot of sand for it. We have to make sure it is even. It's okay, even so bag. we've put the sand. What's next? Hmm. Fill the aquarium nearly to the top, about 1.9 cm from the top, with distilled or filtered room temperature water. Alright, let's fill it up. Two eggs, Why up Two packets. It's time for the water. Can I put it in? Yes, go ahead. Try up food, try up food. Sure. Alright, I need more. Didn't know that it would look like that. It's a bit murky. Yeah. Okay. A bit murky. 1.9, a little bit more. Getting there. Mm. Oh, we can't see the picture anymore. No. Is that 1.9? No, it's a bit more. Okay, let's call it 1.9 centimeters from the top. Next. Pull in the trap eat. Just a minute. Okay, now we've waited for the water to clear, so it's a bit clear now, we can see a bit better. So Jacob is going to pour half of his trap into the, the aquarium and we're just gonna wait to see so I think this thing there's some moss 
like nutri nutrient at the top and that's gonna stay at the top and the eggs are gonna sink to the bottom. And so, they are right now. So I don't know if we can see some eggs at the bottom or if that's too small. We can see some little things floating down. Yeah. These are the eggs. So I think now we're gonna have to put this by the window and to where keep them warm. Where, what does it so they the Yeah, so we're gonna wait. Um, I think it's going to be a couple of days before we see something moving in here. Yes, and, and we should show you. But, but they're super tiny. They look, you'll see little white dots moving around. They're hard to see. Okay, alright. So, okay, I'm going to turn this off and we'll come back when we got some try-ups. Hey, you guys. After only one day, we already have our first trial. We already have our first trial. It's really hard to see. You can see a little white thing dropping down and going back up to the top. So I don't know if you can see. Uh, it's really hard to see. Anyway, it's all first traps. So we'll make some more movies of them as they grow. Up, as they grow. Thank you. Hi everyone. It's day three of the uh, triops growing, and I think you can see them. You can see them a lot better now. Uh, they're probably a couple, two or three millimeters long. So you can see them float around to the top. This looks like they're going to get some food or something like this. So, uh, yeah, it's quite exciting. They're getting quite big quite quickly. So just there at the bottom you can see one that keeps floating down. Looks like he's jumping in the sand and out of the sand. That's really cool. It's fun to see these things grow. Hey everyone, it's day four, I think, day four, day three or day four for uh, the tribes and you can see there's a lot of activity out here. We probably have like ten of them now, so some big ones and some smaller ones, so we fed them yesterday, so hopefully they grow bigger and they all survive. Hey guys, it's day six for our triop experiment and they're growing well, uh, I think we probably have five or six. Uh, there was one just before, just swimming, just here. I don't know, they're a bit hard to see still. It's right at the bottom right now. It's looking into the the sand. Uh, we fed them this morning, and they're doing quite well. I think the water's evaporating a little bit. The level's been going down, so we're just warming up some uh, bottle, some water, bottled water, just to um, fill up the tank. Let's make it a bit bigger. Just make sure they've got enough water. So we fed them yesterday. So feed them every couple of days. So we'll wait a bit longer. Oh, there's one just here. One to the side. You can see that one quite well. To the left side of the screen. So I think there was two there. All right. Let's see two more. Some water. I just warmed up the water. It's been in the sun, so it's probably warm enough now. So just fill up the tank a little bit. Should be up to uh, about two centimeters from the top. Hopefully it doesn't disturb the trap so much. You can see them swirling around into here. Hopefully uh, it's not so bad for them, uh, the water. So, yep. Hey guys, it's day 8 of our experiment with our tribes. And you can see there's a big one there just below the jaw of the dinosaur. And there's another big one uh, floating just above his, his nose. Um, they seem pretty happy. And they seem to be growing quite well. Uh, there's another one here where on this foot. So I think we've got three big ones. I don't see any small ones this morning. They might still be hiding somewhere. So uh, yeah, we'll keep you um, informed how the development goes. Thanks. Hey guys, I think it's the 11 for triops. So you can see there's one just here now, just in the middle of the screen. It's, uh, it's going away. There's another one here at the bottom. So uh, one there in the sand and uh, just before there was one that was doing a loop de loop so that was pretty cool and um, I think it's just calmed down now but uh, you can see one there is pretty excited it's moving quite a lot so it's really really cool really old creatures so I hope you've enjoyed seeing them grow I think they're fully grown now 